all welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm Janelle and this is Janelle Ray Budgets and yes that is a Bo Peep band-aid on my finger. I cut my finger and Amelia picked my band-aid for me so that is what is on me. Um, okay so you guys I miss this so much so we're gonna go and do Saturday night game night. Now if you guys have been around for a while you know that this is where I play games with you all. So the way this is going to work, if you are new here, or if you need a refresher, is we are going to play Clue. So I have um, $50 bills here. I'm going to stick those here. And then we are going to play Clue. So um, the way that this is going to work is I am going to draw from each pile. I'm going to um, shuffle them up, and then I'm going to draw from each pile, and that's going to go in our envelope. And then what I'm going to do throughout the game, or throughout the the randomizing is I'm going to pick a card, a couple cards, and then I will cross them off. Whatever is left on this board is where you guys come in. You will make a guess as to who you think, who you think did it, where they did it, and what they used to do it. So in my next video next week on Saturday when I do game night, I will draw people and I will draw two, at least two people they will get their name written on the back of this and they will be entered in their own contest. If somebody wins, then that person will get $10 um, off in my shop. And then everybody else that is entered into the random giveaway will get, um, I'm sorry, it'll be $15 for the winner, $10 for the other person. So that is how this is going to work. Now, the way that you guys are going to play is you're going to put your guesses in the comments down below. So, like, if you want to guess that it was mustard in the study with the candlestick, that's what you will put. And then you will put a hashtag um, clue, hashtag clue. And if you don't want to play and you just want to comment, that's fine. Just don't push the ha put the hashtag clue. Um, it's so, hashtag clue is for those of you that want to play the game. Um, uh, is that it? Trying to think. Otherwise, other than that, it's just going to be, I'm just going to roll the dice. We're going to go through and put... Um, the money in the envelope and then at the end I'll count it and that is how this is going to work so um okay I think that's it guys that's how this that's how we're gonna play this so I'm gonna do the first one is the person so I'm gonna give these it's hard to shuffle only <laughs> five cards well um so we're gonna do a little random shuffle here and then I'm gonna pick this top person okay and the rest of these are going to be face down now. And then we are going to pick our um, where. So I don't know about you guys, but I love the game of Clue. Like we, we play it. My family plays it. We, my, my kids have grown up loving it. Okay, top one, go in there. And so it's fun for me to do this with y'all um, and let you guys have a chance to actually interact and play the game and win a little bit of something. So we're just gonna give these a quick little shuffle here and then put that there. Okay, so then we're gonna put these all together like this and I'm gonna give them a good shuffle. I'm gonna try not to let y'all see the bottom cards, which you probably just did. Okay, and we'll do it one more time and that way hopefully they get all mixed in there. And then we'll maybe do a little bit of shuffling like this. Just, boop. Well, there went one. <laughs> Get them all nice and good and mixed up here. And this is now our deck that we are going to pick from. Okay, now I'm going to take this. I'm going to slide it in here. And there's our answers. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go ahead and get this. And I'm going to roll and put money in and then here in a second we will pick a card to see where our money is going to go and you guys i'm going to try to use this bowl it's kind of big so i don't know but i'm tired of my dice like flying everywhere i need to get one of those um dice rolling towers but i just haven't gotten one so um we're going to roll in here and then i'm going to try to see what i'm rolling and that's where we're going to put our money to begin with okay so a five. Oh, you know what i'm i'm I need to roll this one. <laughs> so we got a 16 and actually 16 is a wild 
And so I'm gonna go ahead and stick the first into house taxes. And we're gonna do $2 at a time, otherwise this might last forever. So eight is debt snowball, and I'm gonna put the money behind, so it will get $2. And 14. So how is everybody's um, Saturday going? So in Colorado, it is like snowing, like a lot out here in Lakewood. I know there's some people that are from Colorado that live in other parts. And um, it might not be snowing where they are. My brother lives in Parker. And he said that it's like not snowing at all. But out here, I would say we probably got nine to 10 inches of fresh snow on top of the 11 inches we got in the last snowstorm, which was just a week ago. So yeah, it's starting to pile up. My husband is snow plowing, so he is not home at the moment. Um, so yeah, the kids are all here, of course, except for my two older who are in Kansas with their dad. Um, that's a nine. So that's vacation. Okay. And so yeah, they're, they're in Kansas with their dad to watch the Super Bowl. Are you guys all watching the Super Bowl? Um, we are not. We don't. I know it's very weird, but we do not really watch. And I'm going to say it, guys, and I know I'll probably get a lot of slack for it. I am not an Usher fan, so I don't even know. I've always watched the halftime show. Like, I've always just put it on, even if we're not watching the game. Wow, 8 is popular today, um, which is fine because it's that snowball. Uh, but I'm not a huge Usher fan, so I don't even know that I will... <laughs> Even turn on that. So am I going to get a lot of flack for that? <laughs> um, but we, I don't know. I was kind of thinking maybe we might take the kids to the museum. Um, give them something to do. Uh, we haven't been to the museum in a while. And it'd be a, probably a pretty good day to go because there probably wouldn't be very many people there. So we might do that tomorrow on Sunday. But let me know in the comments down below with your answer. If you're going to play, <laughs> make sure you put hashtag clue. But let me know down below if you guys watch the Super Bowl, if you're Usher fans. Um, you know, tell me all the deets on uh, what you guys have planned for the weekend or for Sunday anyways. I'm just hoping it stops snowing soon. Okay, so 15 is birthdays. Okay, and it looks like maybe we're about halfway. So I'm going to go ahead and move that right there. And let's draw our first card. So it is living room. So a living room. So I'm going to go ahead and mark off living room. Let's see. Make sure that you guys can see that it's marked off. So we'll give it a little scribble. And let's pick one more. Kitchen. So did I not get these mixed up very well? <laughs> okay. And so that's two. Let's see. Oh, I'm going to. Okay. Because I just looked and it's like the same thing. So I'm just going to go ahead and try to get these a little more shuffled up here. Let me try shuffling one more time. Okay, let's try one more. Oh, candlestick. Can you guys see that? Candlestick. Okay, so we're going to cross off candlestick. Okay, now we will go back to this. Make sure that that's dry. Okay. Oh, you're smelling. Okay. <laughs> I just didn't want to get it on the back of my binder. Okay. So nine is, what is nine? Vacation. So one and two and nine. Come on. Give us something else that we haven't rolled. An 11. That'll work. That is Tyler. So one, two and Tyler. A three. Okay. This bowl isn't too bad. I thought it was going to be a little bit bigger than it is, but it seems to work okay. It's a little loud, but hope it's not too loud on your guys' end. Are we still recording? Still doing all of our stuff? Yes. Is that nine again? Wow. Okay. Vacation. Seven. What is seven? Car insurance. That's a good one. Okay. 11. Tyler again. 9 again. Oh, 15 is birthdays. So our next birthday is Amelia's. 
That is on the 20th. So she is going to be four. So that is our next birthday. And then we're done with birthdays until May. When Tyler is going to be 18 and graduate all at the same time. Um, business taxes is going to get $2. Yes, my... Uh, my 18-year-old, 17-year-old Tyler is going to be um, graduating in May. And so he graduates May 22nd, and then his birthday is two days later. So pretty cool. He graduates actually at 17, but two days later he turns 18. So three, eight, okay. And I think, yep, this will be our last roll. And it is 14 back here in pets. All right. So I'm going to move this out of the way real quick. Um, let's see. How do we want to do this? Let me get this out of the way because it's kind of big and annoying. So let me move that out of the way. I want to show you guys a couple things. Um, oh, shoot. One of them I don't have. Hold on a minute. I'll be right back. Okay, y'all. So um, let me just show you a couple things real quick. Then we'll count this and maybe draw or I'll draw and then count. I don't know. We'll see. But move this out of the way. And then let me show you. Okay, so this is one thing. This has been added to the shop. I only have one of these right now. But it is a frosted. Um, it's one of the Libby glass um, cups. And it says friends on it. I don't know if you guys can see that. But it's the Mayor, Jack, Sally, um, Oogie. And then the Three Nightmares. Of course. So this is one. There's one in the shop right now. It comes with a glass straw um, that goes in here. I don't want to poke the hole in it, though, because I don't want to push it through. That's for you guys to do. But so that's in the shop right now. And then um, I'm gonna break that. And then I have these here are also in the shop as of right now. So this is a set of four of the vellum and um, laminated with the mat. And these are Harry Potter. So there's this one with the four colors of the houses. There's this one where you can see they're fighting. Um, can you guys see that? I keep pushing it up off the screen. Um, there's that one. There's this one with um, the, I know Hermione and I know Ron and I know Harry. I am not a huge Harry Potter fan, so I'm sorry guys, I'm not. But I think that's Jen Weasley and then I'm not sure what these other, I think, I don't know. I'm not sure what the other ones are. I'm sure you guys out there who are Harry Potter fans can tell me, but, and then there's this one. And I know that this is Snape and I know that's Dumbledore and I know that's Potter and I know that's Hermione and Ron. And then I'm not really sure, but anyways, it's got the label on it so that you guys can put your own label on it. There's four, there's two sets of these and they're in the shop right now and they are in the uh, mat so. and then you guys this is not listed yet but I did make this so this is a budget binder it's a camper it's not like the camper that I already have but it's just this one um this is matte lamination on the front but this is cardstock the front cover and then the inside envelopes match the front cover but they are the vellum with the mat so you can see through them like that so when the money goes in them I have extra dollar laying right here. See, the money goes in them. So they're the same as the vellum, the, you know, Nightmare Before Christmas and whatever. So you can see through them. But it is the camper on it um, with the matte and background, and then it's got its own label. And there are 12 of these little envelopes. Did I do 12 or did I do 10? One, two, three, four, five, six seven, eight, nine, ten. I did ten. Sorry. Ten. There's ten. And um, this is this will be up today. At some point I will get this listed. Um, is that it? I think that's all I have. Just these three things. There's There was nothing else. Um, I've just been messing around with this matte lamination and this vellum. And I really like the way that things look. It's kind of aesthetically pleasing. And they're still pretty sturdy even though they're not cardstock. So I don't know. I just really like the, the look of it. So and then I will be making more of the vellum envelopes. And then I do have a couple of um, like the 
25 envelope challenges that I was doing there for a while. I have them coming out. So there's going to be one with um, this cat paper. Um, I just thought it was really cute. So that's going to be one. And then there's a couple other ones, like a Christmas one, a Halloween one, and a couple other ones that I have that will be coming out, you know, sporadically. But anyways, okay, let's get to, let's see, what do we want to do? Let's draw one card. Boop. So courtyard. Uh-oh. It's not going to give you guys any hints as to who done it. So, but you might have the room solved <laughs> by the time we're done. Okay. Let me make sure that's dry. Okay. So let's go ahead and see what we got here. So how, emergency didn't get anything. House taxes got $4. So we have 100, 200, 20, 40, 60, 84. So $84 there. House insurance got $4. So we got 100, 200, 20, 40, 60, 70, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So 276. Business taxes got $2. So 100, 200, 20, 40, 60, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75. $75 in there. Retirement, didn't get anything. Car maintenance, got $2. So we have 25, 6, 7, 8 in there. 28. Car insurance, got $2. So we got 100, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, right? 20, 20 40, 60, 80, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, and 96. So 296 car insurance. Debt snowball. It got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight dollars. And that is what is in there so far for the month of February. Vacation got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So the favorite numbers this time were eight and nine. So it's got 20, 40, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59. So it's got $59 in there. Ryan has $2. So he has 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. 21 in there. He has 1, 2, 3, 4. And that's all Tyler's going to have in his because, like I said, I'm not making them even anymore. They're going in the same binder, and then I'll just split it at the end. The kids got $2, so they have 20, 1, 2, 3, and 4. Um, homeschool got $2. So 20, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41. 41 in the homeschool. Let's see. Pets got one, two, three, four. So 44 in pets. And our last envelope is birthdays. And it got one, two, three, four, five, six. Six in birthdays. So it has 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. 23 dollars. Okay. So that is it for the stuffing part. Let's draw one more card and see if we can get you guys um, a person. Nope. Rope. Rope. Okay, so rope it is. Okay, guys, this is your board for this time. I hope you can see that. Let me hold it up here. So you have all of the who's. Um, you have bathroom, study, dining room, game room, garage, and bedroom, and you have wrench, dagger, pistol, and lead pipe left. So you guys, if you want to play and make your guesses down below, make sure and add that uh, clue hashtag. And if you don't want to play, go ahead and leave me a comment. Just leave out the clue hashtag. And uh, let me know what y'all are doing for the Super Bowl. Um, I'm interested to know what everybody's thoughts and stuff are for the Super Bowl. So Leave me a comment down below and we will see you guys in the next video, which will be a savings challenge video Monday, hopefully Monday, maybe Tuesday, but hopefully Monday. 
And yeah, so we'll see you guys in the next video. I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your weekend and a great start to your work week. And yeah, that's it. <laughs> Bye, y'all.